All right, time to start. But wait, where is the car? You guys have heard of the Vitara Brezza? Of course, you guys know the Vitara Brezza, the Suzuki Vitara Brezza, which is a mid-size SUV. Yes, you might have seen it in the traffic, you might have seen it in your driveway, but have you seen the Seni Toys version? Guess not. So that's why I bought the Seni Toys with Tara Brezza with me today. And we're gonna unbox this toy, but before that, you guys have to check out the intro of the with Tara Brezza. So here we go. That was a nice intro. Well, comment it down in the comment box, like whether you liked it or not. Anyways, getting on with the car right here, a quality product from Cine Toys. I'd actually ordered a black color one, but they gave me a silver one. You know, Amazon mistakes. Anyways, uh, you get it with various color options, not only these, but remember guys, you don't get the stripes version. Like, trust me, you get all the plain colors, but not the stripes. Well, that's pretty disappointing. No door openables, sadly, and no sunroof like the Creta. And also, it has been a long time since I've come for Seni Toys because I was busy building this. Okay, for the guys who know this car, you guys can skip forward. But for the people who don't know, check it out. This uh, Airfix Quick Build McLaren P1. It'll be up in the i button right here, guys. If you like to build some cars, this is the product for you. So, all right, now I'm not mentioning about that. First, 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 let's go for the unboxing of this Brezza. But if you guys are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button down there real quick. And also follow me on Instagram and Facebook. And don't worry, the links for this car will be in the description. Here we go. <sighs> Whoops, wrong direction. And back right here. Well, guys, looking at the Vitara Brezza. First look, it's very nicely detailed. You've got this chrome... Uh, front finish which is very nice it actually goes along with the headlamps so yeah cool attention to detail in the interior part I was really impressed by looking at the interior because it has a proper infotainment system which I hope you guys can see there right yeah and the door panels are also very well detailed love the details in this car and of course can't forget the wheels these are the original Maruti Suzuki Vitara Brezza's wheels guys of course there are a little bit of gaps in them but uh, at least this is best I mean this is really nice and can't forget the details of their tires because the tires are way too cool with that grip solid grip like look it's really nice and Seni toys written down here fake exhaust tips because there's only one uh, pipe right here so look at the back yes this is how it looks proper tail lamps I really like the design and that's pretty much it on this car no sunroof no door openable let's hear the pullback here we go okay that's pretty nice guys I like the power on this pretty cool well now let's go for its info Let's talk specs of the Suzuki Vitara Brezza right here. First, going on with the top speed. Top speed is ranging from 170 to 175 kilometers per hour. That's 108 miles per hour. Not bad, but not good either. And going for the acceleration time, uh, well, it's from 10 seconds to about 12 seconds, guys. Yes, some engine variants perform it in 10 seconds, but 
some of them go up to 12 which is not so good not so bad and going for the horsepower yeah some engine displacements produce 89 horsepower whereas some other displacements produce 103 and that's the maximum you can get it to uh in stock that is well going for the engine uh the 1.5 liter k15b is an inline four petrol engine and you have another one with a diesel option that's a 1.3 liter d13a and in transmissions you have a 5-speed manual if you are a car enthusiast or if you guys just are lazy to shift, you can go for the 4-speed automatic. And talking about its body style, which you guys already know, it's a 5-door mid-size SUV. And this car is available in front-wheel drive. All-wheel drive variants are pretty rare to find. And talking about its ratings, guys, as the information is up. The ratings, I give it a 9.5 out of 10 because of its details only, not for its performance. So yeah, you guys let me know in the comment box. I'm curious for your answer. All right, guys, that's the end of the info. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. I'll see you all next week. And follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Don't forget that. Don't, don't worry, the links for this car will be in the description. So bye-bye, stay tuned. DCS out. Thanks for watching and do subscribe!